Welcome to Cosmic Constellations, an exciting NASA STEAM program which investigates our glorious night sky through the lens of art and culture. Developed for NASA's Discovery and New Frontiers programs, Cosmic Constellation fuses the exploration of astronomy, cultural sky stories and mythology, while fostering creativity and storytelling. Why were the heavens so important to ancient cultures? Where do star myths and oral traditions come from? Who were the great ancient astronomers? Explore these topics and more while creating your own constellation stories and beautiful artworks. Cosmic Constellations includes many exciting highlights. Learners investigate ancient sky stories and star myths. They also explore space science through cultural pathways. The program uses real sky charts to inspire learning through creative art making and storytelling. And the process offers many paths to support additional research, literacy, social studies, and even math skills. And the program is great for all learners in both formal and informal settings. Cosmic Constellations is implemented in five phases and makes a robust multiple session investigation. We'll go through each phase in detail, but here's an overview. First, you will prepare the materials and download the free resources. You'll also want to collect some art supplies. Then you'll explore key concepts with learners. You'll also ask them to imagine their own constellation and create stories inspired by real scars sky charts. And students will make beautiful artworks illustrating their concepts, which will in turn inspire story ideas. Finally, we'll give you tips on how you can show, share, and celebrate student works. To get prepared, head to our website where you can download all the free resources, access the PowerPoint with detailed notes. You'll also need to print the PDF sky charts. There's two versions, one with lines and one without. These will be used to inspire learners' constellation stories and artwork. There's also a PDF sky key, which shows how you can reassemble the Northern night sky and read what the sky chart symbols mean. You'll also find our constellation fun fact cards and many examples of student work to inspire you. Once you're prepared, it's time to engage with students. What are the constellations, their origins and mythology? Use the sky chart that has lines and the associated key to create a large grid of the night sky. Have fun talking with learners, investigate and dig deeper. And feel free to add your own twist by pairing your investigating with student research, constellation books, videos, and more. After you've investigated constellations and sky stories, it's time to delve into the art project. Each maker will pick a sky chart to inspire storytelling and drawing. Print the sky charts that do not have lines onto 11 by 17 paper. You can also print and scale them smaller to 8.5 by 11 if you need. You can use one sheet or combine the matching sky charts for larger drawings. The sky key will show you how the charts fit together. Look at the dots and do what the ancients did. Can you see patterns in the stars? Have makers think of their own stories as they create. Have learners sketch directly onto their sky prints. You do not need to use every star, just the major ones you want to include. You also do not have to connect each dot. Many constellations are drawn around the stars with just line segments to indicate basic shapes. You can even use only geometric shapes like circles, triangles, polygons, and line segments to reinforce math skills. Remember, the drawing process tends to spark storytelling, so have learners share their ideas as they see more patterns in their sky charts and create more interesting tales of discovery. 
Next, you'll want to have students transfer their sketches to beautiful watercolor or mixed media paper. You can use transfer paper to transfer the drawing, or you can flip your drawing over and cover the back of your sky chart with graphite. A great technique is to tape your sky chart to a window to use as a light box and add your graphite to the back of the drawing. Trace over both your constellation sketches and each star you're including. If you tape the top of the sky chart to the watercolor paper, you can lift up the sketch from the bottom to check your work. Once the sketches have been transferred, it's time to refine and decorate your constellation drawing. We recommend outlining the stars and major lines with Sharpie as these tend to get lost with watercolor and ink washes. Then you can erase all extra smudges and pencil marks with big white erasers. You'll use oil pastels or crepas to add color to your designs. Adding white will make cool effects once you add watercolor washes too. Some students really like collaborating during this process. Finally, it's time to add beautiful watercolor washes to your creations. We recommend mixing light fast watercolor or acrylic inks with Sumi ink for a beautiful deep blue, but make sure the wash is transparent so the oil pastel would, will emerge. Place drawings on paper or tablecloth and spray a little water on your paper to pre-wet it. Use foam brushes and even strokes to add your wash. The oil pastel drawing will emerge and create cool textures and effects. You can even add a little salt to get a stippled texture in the night sky. Once your drawings are dry, it is time to show, share, and celebrate your work. And don't forget to capture student constellation stories in written form or in a presentation. You can host a gallery show, make narrated digital stories, or even create iPad videos. The sky key will also show you how to reassemble the night sky drawings. And mostly have fun learning, discovering, sharing, and celebrating creativity.